What's up guys, Bearded here, and today I bring you a video that I don't often do, but I feel it's necessary to do so now. Uh, in this video I am apologizing, I'm apologizing because I've got a problem. It's not a drug problem, it's not a fatal problem, it is a mental problem, and thus I'm going on break until August 3rd. But BK, are you sure you're going to be back? This is about the fifth time that you said this. Fret not. I will be back. I am for sure going to be back. I just kept jumping the gun. Um, I will not be going into my life story to explain this, but I will be going to a slight explanation. The time During the time that I am gone, it won't just be silence. I, uh, I'll still be on social media and there still will be Conan videos. I don't have the time to edit, but I kind of already got into something with Seb and uh and gaming evolved like uh basically there's a conan server and there's three of us there's there's, well, there's three teams um there's syntac and i think syntac and no there's flinger and cheese syntac and jim and then there's me and seb i said listen i can still do the videos with you i just won't record myself but you can record we'll still make it a thing we'll still make it happen um, I just don't have time to edit and then he came up and offered to edit and I said no it's that's like double the work for you um, but he said he doesn't mind he he doesn't mind doing collab videos and uh, I said okay if if you're okay with it sure um, I appreciate him very much for doing this uh, it would not be possible without Seb this is only temporary um, uh, I'm still like a very small youtuber it's not like i'm just gonna start having an editor but um i don't know why i did this motion but anyways so i'm gonna start going to the explanation of things i kind of um i actually had to type this one out because there was a lot that i wanted to explain and i wanted to do it in the most efficient way possible so um here goes with the, it's it's don't worry it's not like my life story it's just a quick explanation but there's also like multiple things that I have to explain. So back in high school, I was diagnosed with ADHD of the attentive type. In other words, I have the memory of a goldfish at times, and even though I might not act it, my mind gets hyper and jumps between thoughts. So I could be thinking of one thing and I might talk about it, and then all of a sudden my mind jumps to another thing, and then all of a sudden I have to talk about that. Oftentimes I turn to marijuana to help ease my mind. Um, it's not all the time, but it's sometimes. And I don't use it heavily. I I understand marijuana is still a concerning issue to some. Um, but I, I mean, it's already decriminalized in Canada. And it's a, uh, by the end of the summer, they're going to start selling it at designated locations. I don't only use it to ease my mind from all the multitasking. After long and hard physical work days, I use it to help me sleep when I'm aching. When I speak of multitasking, I can do two time-consuming things at, at a time. Oftentimes, it's uh, like I can only do one task each day at a time. It's more like I, I can multitask two time-consuming things per week. I can't do more. I can do less, obviously, but I can't do anything more than that. Right now, I've got three things on the go. I have content creating, whether it's videos for YouTube or live streaming on Twitch. You want to check out my Twitch link in the description. Uh, there's also my internship, and now I have a part-time job that, uh, well, it's supposed to be part-time, but it feels like I am full-time. Uh, when I got hired, quite a few people suddenly quit. I think it was because it is stressful with how the schedule and assignment assigned tasks uh, are so disorganized. Not to mention I often get caught in the middle of arguments on who is going on break and who gets to cover the person going on break. Um, it's often worth the paycheck in the end though. I have an income again which is great. Uh, it means I can start saving towards a new phone. I'm trying to get the new Galaxy S9. Uh, there's also new games coming at the end of the summer, at least starting at the end of the summer. Uh, new tech like perhaps a 4k camera uh, for better content and so on and uh, I just I keep 
I want to become better. I want to keep doing what I'm doing. I, I want to keep going with content creating. I I want to be able to actually do it and not say I'm going to do it. But anyways, so because I'm multitasking three things, it's always stressful enough on me. And then I remember I have a community to care for, which is you guys. And I just start to worry and I stress and then I don't have enough time, but I still try to schedule it for uh, when I can do it next. I end up giving false hope not only to myself, but to you guys as well. I am putting a burden on you guys and that's not okay. If I want to do this, I need at least three quarters of my time to put into it. Otherwise, it just doesn't work out. Uh, I mean, it, it's clear. I've tried many times. Um, I end up not being able to create the comedy that there needs to be. Uh, and I can't have the consistency that you guys desire. So I need time to not only take care of myself, but to refresh my mind. To get the internship out of the way. And once that's out of the picture, I'll be done college for good because um, the internship goes until August 3rd and then I don't get the graduation form until September but after August 3rd like that's I'm done like I'm just gonna stay here they send it in the mail that's it I might have to go up there for like a graduation ceremony but we'll see I don't really want to go up there <laughs> but yeah once once that August 3rd happens uh, it'll be much less stressful I'll be able to do the things that I want to do and um, I'll be able to be there for you guys. So I am saying sorry, not just because I am Canadian, but because I should have done this in the first place instead of dragging it out, thinking that I could have done it. I obviously could not do it, and I couldn't accept the fact that I was still being held back from doing my passion, and the stress was also affecting my work in the internship, meaning I was falling behind on some things, and... Uh, I have to thank Benedict Tackleton for that, his channel, uh, you can check out his channel in the corner here. He was the one that said to me I should stop trying to say that I'm doing something but I'm not because I tried to say every Monday, Wednesday, Friday I was going to live stream on Twitch because it's easier than having to edit but it still, it still takes up a chunk of time. There would be days where I'm just exhausted from work and it just... Like, I'd, I'm not in the mood to stream. And then I have to say, oh, sorry, I can't do it. And then, uh, oh, they scheduled me over the time frame where I'm supposed to stream. I can't stream that day either. And it's like, yeah, it's just it's just a mess. So I'm saying sorry to all my viewers, my friends, and my colleagues. But here's the plan for right now. I will steam. I will steam. I'm going to steam. No. I will stream at random when I get the chance. There's no set day. There's no set day in the week that I will be doing it. I still I want to still try for Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but I think in the end I'm just going to do it when I have a day off. I'm caught up with my internship and I'm just like basically it's probably just going to be racing games, nothing really competitive just because I can't really get into that right now. Um or maybe some survival games, we'll see. Yeah, like, like I said, I will not announce it in advance, it'll be last minute. If you want to know when I do go live, um, you can always tell on Twitch to notify you when I do go live, but there's also, in my Discord, I have a channel called Hashtag Streams, and a bot announces, I think, 15, 10 or 15 minutes after I go live, I think he updates every so many minutes anyway. Um, I will also most likely be in my Discord when I am working for the internship on my PC or when I'm simply on an hour break uh, at my part-time job. There's also my Twitter. I often post pictures and videos of Callie and other feline friends. Uh, links are always in the description down below. I will also be moved into my own office by August, I hope. Um, or at least I... I think it depends on how quickly uh, how quickly it gets finished because the contractors are basically building the skeleton and then 
both me and my dad, when we get the chance, we're going to eventually like cover the walls with drywall and then just like put, put paint the walls and everything and um, just set it up so it's like we can live in it. And then one of the rooms that is currently not part of the extension, but is uh, I guess my dad's bedroom right now, he is going to move his bedroom into the extension and his old bedroom is going to become my office. It's just kind of going to become an office in general, but for the time being, it's my office. And uh, it's going to include some soundproof walls, which I'm pretty excited for. Um, and I'll also be looking into a green screen for when I stream and stuff. But anyways, um, other than that, I'll also hopefully be getting a car again to ease up how I get around. There was, uh, I had a small accident in uh, the winter at college. There was a mix up with uh, bylaws and I have to clear that up in court uh, I don't think I have to go personally but uh, just because the way things worked out I'm not gonna go into details but um, that's going to be cleared up in July so we have to wait and see for that so keep the date of August 3rd in your calendars that'll be roughly the time when I get back I will be back with more content from video games to skits, which I've been jotting down new ideas for when the time comes in a Google Doc. It's, uh, it's starting to get pretty lengthy, so uh, I can't wait to apply what I've written down into uh, video form. Also, as I mentioned earlier, big thanks to Seb. He is giving me a kind hand in editing our collab vids. Uh, it would not be possible without him. He is like a brother to me and uh, I will still be doing Conan vids with him like I said um, I, I guess I will be recording, but he will be editing them for me They will be released when they are and Seb is simply lending a hand. I, like I said before, this is just temporary So big thanks to Seb check out his channel up here and tell him how much I appreciate him So guys, that's all I had to say. That's uh, what I have for an explanation, that's the plan for what's going to happen. Uh, I'm doing this last minute, so it's a bit of a messy explanation. I'm sorry for that. But that's it. Oh, also, for when I come back, click the top link in the description to vote on what you want to see for when I get back. There, uh, there are some pre-selections of games and time frames and... Uh, like skits but there are also sections where you can enter in your own answer but yeah so for now i'm going on break and i can't wait to be back i can't wait to see your beautiful faces when i get back and uh, hopefully things turn out for the better so as always guys bye from yao